Hello dear researchers, I hope you are doing great. In this tutorial, we are going to see how we can generate a survey or Likert scale survey code book. And we are going to see how we can do this uh, automatically using spaces provided that we entered all the labels and values appropriately. All right. So if we have our Likert scale survey or questionnaire on spaces, so we can just uh, go to this is like a template of the questionnaire and we can find here the labels and values as you can see so this means that we can generate the code book of this uh, questionnaire so what we do here is we go to file and then we look for an option that is called uh, display data file information that is this option here and we click working file we click on it and wait for the output uh, window to be displayed and therein we are going to find the uh, the code the or the code book that is used for the questionnaire okay so this is the code book as you can see so i have two because i did this uh, twice so we can find this uh, as variable uh, variable information and this one as variable values so i'm going to take this one variable values uh, copy it and paste it into office uh, so it's, it's gonna be pasted this way or you know i have different options to paste it and so i can opt for this option then I can edit it a little bit by increasing and decreasing the size of the tables and adding some titles, etc. till I finish it and I get it uh, in this way, okay? So this is its uh, final uh, form. Okay, so this is how we can go about getting the, uh, the codes or the code book of Likert scale questionnaire or surveys using a spaces uh, provided that there is the code there in a spaces as i said so you can see here the codes uh, so each one is accorded the number or value and each category is accorded the value etc okay for the record scale we have one to five strongly disagree to strongly agree so this is how we do it in brief if you have questions or remarks do not hesitate to post them below or contact me via one of my social media and uh, uh, I would like to see you in another tutorial soon bye for now